Hello and welcome back to Autonauts. I'm Avon and in the last episode we made a broom. Today we are going to use the broom. Or, or are we? Yes, we are. We are going to automate the making of the broom and we're going to automate the usage of a broom. So let's put it there. Let's find a bot. I guess we do not need a speedy bot. Let's see, we have research complete as well. That was not enough time to do anything productive before it finished, but that's nice, I guess, that it's done. So we got the wheelbarrows, we got the bridges, and we got the uh, something else as well. I believe it was a walkway or a road. Let's see. So uh, let's quickly look at the research so we can start another one. That's not the research menu. This is here. Okay. So we did the transportation transportation technology that was mainly for the good wheel I believe because we needed for something it might be the bot data bank now I think what we're going to do is going to go for the mechanical frame saw because we always need more and apparently we have a lot right now oh well we're going to do this anyway just because so we're going to get rid of this axe we're going to axe the axe. Sorry about that one. And up, up, up. there we go. Axe inside and hearts can go on top of the axis. And we're good. Let's see. Uh, oh, it's in progress. This one isn't in progress. We can look at the recipe here. Plank pole fixing peg. That was quite easy. Okay, so let's do that one as well. But first, Let's do this. I was going to say, but first, let me take a selfie. I managed to not say it until I did. So, um, here we go. This is going to be the broom crate. If brooms go into crates, let's uh, hover. Yeah, it does. Good. We can, uh, I guess we can put it in the box right away. I guess we need one anyway to teach the uh, bot how to how to use it. But okay, so um, stick and four sticks and one pole. So let's start with the one pole. Take pole, store pole, get sticks. Good, and we do that four times four times. It's been a while since we coded any of these. So that's uh, the bot does it four times. We need to do it four times as well to fill the thingy. So we make a broom and can move the broom to teach the bot how to move the broom. So picked up four of these. Then we go over to this thing and uh, I'm just going to get rid of these. Now we uh, retrieve that's the important bit. Good. And then we insert. So we move and retrieve and add. And we retrieve and add five times because, because this includes uh, everything. And it's easy this way. It's not needed this way. What we could have done is insert or add to workbench four times, then retrieve, then add. But this thing is smaller on the code. So uh, that's good. Now we pick it up and put it in the box. And we do this forever. So this is uh, broom make slash start. Uh, we do that forever because then the box will end up in front of the box like these ones. The box is full so it can't insert and so on so it stops. Uh, here. That's fine. And I don't think we can do any fancy coding on this. So this is going to happen. We're going to have 10 brooms. That's nice. We also uh, did find a bot without any shoes. That's nice as well because we don't need shoes on the making of the item spots because we're not going to use that many brooms. So let's find our um, team where we're going to have the broom bot. 
that's going to be in the in the removal team. I think it's going to be in the first one. Yes, it is. So here we find this boat, and that's you. You have boots, that's fine. Good, and you're going to be a sweeper, I guess. Sweep with broom. Now, I don't know how to code this because I don't know how um, it works, but I am going to do an if here to try something new, and that's going to be Oh, 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 I'm going to do any else, of course. If hand not full, pick up a broom. Or else, use the broom. So, uh, let's find something we can use the broom on. Let's see. We might have to code it for each and every item. Move to litter. Okay, oh, that's really nice. So that might cover everything. It probably doesn't cover what, uh, what we want it to do. Of course, because nothing's as easy as that. But here we go, and then do that forever. I think that's it. Let's start you. No, 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 no. Come on. Uh oh. Where did Bot go? Hello? Oh. Oh, wow, it's so quick. Oh, okay, so it already got a broom. Silly bot. Um. Well, then let's store our brain. Okay, so you can go sweep stuff. Let's see, it's probably going to sweep this and maybe this. This is so nice. Yeah. Oh, and here we have a bird. Yeah. That's going to be quite annoying if, uh, if it's going to eat all of the grass or the stuff we want to feed the animals. But I think we can use a scarecrow then. Ah, oh, the bird looks nice though. It's a nice and kind of square bird. So, um, that's that. That's the brim. Uh, what else? What else? We, um, uh, we're going to look at the new recipes. Ah, oh, this is nice. The sand and stone. I don't think we have a bot that uses the, um, sand yet. Now this is the road I don't really like the look of so I'm hoping we get an upgrade because placing sand on grass feels a bit wrong. But uh, let's see. Uh, let's find out if we have a construction box. It's not here, it's the blueprint one. Yeah we do actually. That's nice. So let's make some of these. Okay, and then let's remove these. Oh yes, we were going to make the uh, the uh, good wheel. Good wheel. So um, let's make a couple of boxes as well, so we uh, don't run out of those. I'm going to use this thing. Ah. Let's place it afterwards. So I think we're going to use this area. Uh, what we can do is fill this or, or go a bit further down. That's fine as well. Uh, I'm also, oh, I'm going to add, uh, I'm going to add a recharge bot. Let's see, you record. You need to find uh, recharge, sure. Move to discharged in removal. I think that's enough uh, because when this thing is out of power, we'll just fix that. Or later on, if we really want to, we can add another one. So we can recharge the recharge bots. So uh, recharge removal. Good. Add that to the removal team. There we go. Add it to removal or to recharge. No, I think we keep it in the removal team because it needs to follow the sign. And then we need to... Yes, good gear. 
And the good gear was made in a wood shaping bench. I'm not sure if we have any of those. Um, vehicle assembly unit. Let's make one of those. Oh, wow, that's huge. So, um, mm, wood shaping, right? Yeah, wood shaping. Okay, we don't have any of those. So we need to make, let's make three of them at least. That's a nice Tetris going on. And then uh, we need a crank and a crude blade. Do we have cranks being made? I don't think so. But we do have crude blades being made somewhere. Weird. So if we don't have cranks made, let's get cranks made as well. That's it. Oh, I got one too many now. Mm -hmm. Place eight. Oh, it's done. There and there. And then let's make another one. So we get rid of the this one. Okay. And and we got the broom. We were going to do the um, crank as well. Now we need to find out where the crank is made. It's probably made in the same thing. No, it's not because we needed to make that thing. So uh, let's find out where it's made and see if we have that. That was a crank. That's here, structural workbench. And that would be, not this one of course, because we have that one. And it wouldn't be fun if we already had them. Let's see, now we're to place. We can remove this and place it there. Good. So it's a bit hard to build stuff when we don't have... Uh... Oh, but we do have. That's lucky. So we're going to place this here, I think. Yeah, that, that's good enough. And do we have flooring? Yes. That's good. And we already have the recipe set. And now we need a crate to put it in. Does that look wonky compared to this? Do we want to turn it? Um, like so. We can still walk across. So, so I think we're going to do that. Like so. Hmm. Because we can't walk across, so it doesn't mess with anything. Okay, so two poles, two fixing pegs. Let's get a bolt. And, and let's see if we have room in the backpack, and we do. Uh, so I want room in the backpack as well. So let's get this one and dump it here. Then we get things. Two poles and two fixing bags. So pole and stow. Two times. No, we repeat that two times. I could do could do either way, but uh, I think stowing is enough to click once. Let's see if that is true. Uh, stow, yeah, good. And then we pick up fixing peg, and we pick up twice, two times. Then we go down here, insert. Oh, and we need the second one as well. Good. Then we record retrieving. So uh, we retrieve, retrieve. Up here, and we do this four times. Four times, and after that, we pick up and put in box. And this you do forever. So this is crank make slash store. Now it's quite it's quite fast. I surprised myself with the speed. Or is it's not that I'm working really fast. It's that it doesn't take that long to program something like this. 
So I, I have a tendency to manually make stuff instead of setting up the bot, but the bot doesn't take a lot longer than making one. Uh, or at least it doesn't take longer than making it, say, one time and then a second time a little later, where you have to look up the recipe and find the workbench and all of those things. So you are the crank bot that's here, and that's a part, and that would be um, not tool, that's part construction, there. Good. And let's see how we're doing with the workbenches. We have the structural workbench that we already had, so that's not very impressive. Uh, let's move it down here actually so we can use it if we need to, but we want uh, we don't want that one. We want this one. Wait, what? We had one already being made. Oh, joy. Okay, so we need one crude blade. That would be here. Oh, and now we have the cranks made. Okay, yeah, so that makes... That makes making them a lot simpler. So, uh, here we go. That's nice. Four of these. We probably need five though. We have uh, quite an amount of these now. Which is nice because, because the bots are apparently struggling with building them. Because we're out of stuff. So I'm going to place the last one so these get finished by the bot when, uh, when it's time. And then we're going to look at this thing. We have both stuff so it's just the bot being slow. The, construction bot and it's probably this one <laughs> out of power poor thing so wood shaping bench and that was for that was for um, uh, the uh, good wheels so let's do the same here uh, do we like that maybe here and then we move it here looks a bit cramped but but it's nice to build a bit cramped as long as it doesn't mess with anything so I'm going to I'm going to let it stay there uh, as long as we don't mess with any pathing it's fine like this good now this one is a bit more awkward to make I think the boat is going to need two trips for this uh, which is fine so um, Let's start with blocks. That's uh, hold up. Uh, we do not have um, the backpack space for three items. Uh, no. So so we can do three trips, or we can get a backpack upgrade and do two trips. I'm going to look at. Uh, let's see, if we do... Uh, three trips. I'm, I'm kind of thinking, what if we do something weird like this? If hands are not empty, we go here to place items. Then hands are empty and we're going to end up on the else part. But how do we make it cycle between the items? The plank pole or a fixing peg? I don't think that's possible with this kind of coding. Uh, the reasoning for looking for this is that the coding of walk down here and place in here three times, that's a lot of code. But I'm going to see if we have enough. Uh, if we have enough space for it. So let's... Uh, remove this and start again. So, uh, oh, we didn't pick up because thingy is busy. Jeez, that was difficult. So, let's place you back. Let's grab one. Okay. So, we do that uh, three times. Then we go down here and add and do that three times. That's 14 left. 
uh, one, two, three, one, two, three. So they start at 20. So six, that's 12 more, which means it won't have enough capacity to put in the box. So it needs, uh, it is going to need either brain or backpack. And I think I'm going to make it a backpack. So you stay there, little bot, and I'll get you some backpack. Uh, do we have a bot workbench? This one is still considered a basic bot workbench. Oh, they all are. I thought they were upgraded. Let's click these so they don't blink anymore. Basic bot workbench. Okay, so we have a couple of these. Uh, let's see what we need. Yeah, one pole and three planks. That's fine. One pole, stash, and three planks. Spam clicking to to get uh, uh, because we don't have priority to the thing. The bots are kind of taking the slots. Okay, so. That was fast enough. Let's get rid of this and let's do the coding now. So uh, we take from plant storage, plank storage, let's see. We need another one, uh, actually we need two. And we can place one in here and the other one we stop. Good. And then we get one more item, that would be poles. Nice. And we do that three times as well. Which is a problem right now. Yeah. Upgrade locked. It's possible to upgrade the storage. Nice. Oh, and we have the frame saw. That's very good timing actually, because we are running out of the different products here. So I'm going to start the new uh, science thing while waiting. We need the cereal seed for something. Nope. So let's do, we don't have a coconut. We don't have dung, I believe. We might have a torch somewhere. Hmm. Let's get a stone. We need the stone for the cottage. We don't have any stone either. <laughs> Let's go find a stone on the beach. So uh, I feel like I've been running around doing stuff this whole episode and there's still so many things we need to do. This game is busy, busy, busy work. So uh, we don't have poles. We don't have panels. We're running out of planks. We do have logs though. And so uh, we need to change up our tactic while this is filling up a bit. I want to find the bot we were in the middle of programming though because I don't remember. I can't find that one. It's this one. Nice. That wasn't too hard to find at least. So Oh, let's set you down there. It is the good wheel. Good wheel maker. So uh, we can definitely, definitely uh, do this because we can teach it to retrieve. That would be, uh, yeah, just like that. And then pole storage, three, and then we Put it in here. Move to retrieve and add. Oh, this is some sneaky. Uh oh, no! What did I do? I messed up. I think. Let's see. Um, let's start at the very beginning. I confused myself now. So we get planks. Three of them. We stow them. We do not move down. We. Uh, let's see. We move to, uh, um, let's see, retrieve goes in here. So plank, take, stow, pole, take, go down, 
retrieve and place six times. Good. Okay. How, how the heck did that take so much space though? Because this is using 11, I believe. And if we did it in two times, it would just take 12. So we still can't use the same bot for everything, I believe. Let's see, let's just code the rest of it. So we need fixing pegs, three, right? Yeah. So fixing peg. Um, not four times, but three times. Then we add three times. Now, what I was thinking was if we could use, if we could get this thing to repeat uh, here, uh, I guess it would be awkward because this one does it six times and this thing does it three times. Anyway, okay, so uh, we add. We add to the wrong machine. Okay. So we don't add there. We add to there. Three. Here and three times. I bet someone was screaming at the screen then, but it's fine. I think it's fixed. Yeah, it seems fine. So we need those two poles that we don't have. Uh, but this thing does not have enough capacity. Uh, so we either need a brain or we need a new bot. Do we have any tier one bots? Yeah, so we can use this to move the product. So what we need now is just two poles. I'm going to sneakily steal two poles here. There we go. So uh, we place these here. That's good. We now have a good wheel. That means we might be able to finish this. But we need to. Okay. And it's stage two out of three as well. So let's see how, how much room this thing. Yeah. It's not enough. So uh, I'm going to copy that. I'm going to delete it. Oh, uh, we uh, need the loop as well. So good wheel make, but not store. So this thing is only going to be made until until this is full forever because we don't want to stack them up here and if the other bot is a bit slow or if this one fills. So we need to do it the old way, I guess. So uh, place this here just to teach the bot. That's good wheel store. Pick up and go forever. I think that's it. And I probably did something weird with the birding on the uh, maker bot. Did I? Good wheel make. No, it's nice. Good. So. Uh, we have two of these. I'm not going to finish this. This is exciting. People are saying that this, this is major. It took a while to make. And it's going to take a tiny bit of time to finish, but not that bad. So this is going to be finished, uh, finished very soon. And I am sorry to say, but that soon is going to be in the next episode because we are running out of time but stuff was made I'm happy with the stuff we made we're doing fine on bots 
uh, we might want one bot here and we are actually doing decent on food as well and research is happening faster than we can make stuff. We still haven't made all of these. I'm looking forward to making all of these. And let's see. Oh, we have uh, a bunch of boxes now. That's nice. And the boxes are probably what cleared out our stuff as well. And these, did we plan ahead? Yeah, we actually did plan ahead good enough because we, we do have room for these things. That's that's going to help a lot. So I'm going to make a couple of these and and then see if we have stuff for it. Now, even if this is going to bork our wood production a bit because it needs a lot of parts, uh, getting these done are going to help the wood uh, production thing a bit. So, uh, so, stone. This is the last thing we're going to do today. I'm going to make another stone bot. Uh, or maybe I'm going to upgrade one of the stone mine bots. Let's look at it. I don't think, I don't think it hurts us to just leave these running. We just need to stop one when it's done. We can use you, that's fine. So, uh, that's good. And we, oh, we only have two of them. Okay, no wonder it's slow. So, you are now YouTube something. That's a nice link. I guess I've been on YouTube. It was, uh, <laughs> I have no idea what it was. Let's see. So, uh, stone mine, copy that. And here we go, stone mine three, and that goes there. Good. So now we have some additional stone. Do we want more than some additional stone? It seems like we're quite out of it. So I'm going to make another one. Let's see, your name is YouTube 4. Good. Now, talking about YouTube, uh, it's very nice if people subscribe. But I guess if people are actually watching this video this far into the series, they probably have subscribed already. Anyway, oh, this is all clean now, so we can look into this as well. So, so thank you all for watching, and I hope to see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.